Hi, I'm Julie Baldo, and today I'm here with Eddie Huber, who is one of the assistant directors of Us in the Sun, it's a day camp here in Yorba Linda, and it's hosted at St. Martin de Porres. Mm -hmm. um, I've been part of it for 30 years, but for somebody who's never heard of Us in the Sun, what is this? So Us in the Sun is the day camp that we put on through St. Martin de Porres Church, um, and it's basically just the summer camp for the, for the whole summer. There's different weeks that we offer, and basically what it is, is just a summer camp that we do for the kids where it's based strongly in its Catholic faith and we want to just be the face of Christ, the face of love to anybody that comes. Um, now this can take form in a lot of different ways, but basically the kids just come, they, we take them to the beach one day, we take them to the park one day, and then we just fill the days with all sorts of random activities. Like skits. Uh, skits and, and religious Concerts. And, yeah, concerts <laughs> and dances and whatever it, is, whatever it is to make these kids feel loved because I think the ultimate goal of it is just to get the kids to feel, to see themselves as God sees them, which is a beloved child who's precious in his eyes. And um, the camp is for what ages? So the camp is, it ranges from all ages from as young as like three years old all the way through high school. So um, basically, if you are three years old up until your seventh grade year, mm -hmm. you are a camper. You'll be assigned to a specific age group, uh, age appropriate group with your own individual counselors and your own individual volunteers. And then if you are, going into seventh grade and up to senior year of high school. Okay. You are a volunteer. So you are you'll be assigned to a counselor, you'll be assigned to an age group and you basically just have to, you know, help with the with the kids. There's a lot because there's a lot of them, you know, making sure that everything's going well. It's a little more leadership role. Yeah, okay. it's more of a leadership okay. role, which is honestly like I never was a camper. I never did because I used to live in Chino Hills, so um, I never got to experience never got that. to experience camp oh. as a camper, but I did get to experience it as a volunteer and I felt like crazy in love with the camp. Yeah. Um, the relationships that you build with the campers is, is really special. It's something that the campers will remember you for years and years and years. And honestly, I don't think I, my, my own faith life wouldn't be the same without it. My own life in general, I don't know where I would be without camp, but it just taught me so much about how to love, how to be loved, um, how to be accepted for who I am and how, and my best friends all come from camp as well. Yeah. Um, so if people want to go to camp, yeah. how do they sign up? Where do they register? So you can register at usinthesun.com. It okay. has all the information. So us in the sun, uh, sun, S-O-N, as in, you know, son of God. Of course. Um, this will actually be our 39th summer. I don't know if I said that, but um, yeah. So you register at usinthesun.com and it has all the information on how to register, all the dates for the, the dates of camp. It has, uh, you know, the other things that we have as well. Family camp. Yeah, family camp, leadership camp, which is two weekend trips that we take up. They'll have information on that as well. And, uh, you know, bios about the staff, pictures, how to contact us if you have any questions or whatever, it is all there on the usinthesun.com. Awesome. This is a great camp. Um, personally, I love it. I fell in love with it, mm. working at it, and then I just feel so comfortable sending my kids. I feel They feel safe, they feel loved, they have a great time. Mm. Yeah, so thank you very much for no all problem. you do. Absolutely. Sunshine, pass, pass it, it on. on. <laughs> Catch you next time.